Looking for fast, cheap, and reliable coins, look no further than my sponsor, MuckReserve.com. Head over to MuckReserve.com. They're awesome to work with. They got super cheap, fast, and reliable coins. Make sure you use code Poodle at checkout for an additional 15% off your order. Hello, everybody. It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team video, guys. And today, we got the Zero Chill promo. It is in-game. Yesterday, we did make the early reveal, of course, but now we have the actual promo in-game. We're going to go over everything, show you the cards, show you everything in-game, of course. Now, it's looking super, super exciting. Overall, this promo, um, I'm going to be honest, this Zero Chill promo might be one of the best promos we've ever gotten in terms of just bulk usable cards right because we've had an issues where we've had cards like we've had promos that have tons of cards like but you look at them and you're like wow none of these are actually usable like there's always like one or two that are usable this promo has even low cards that are usable like usually the only usable cards in some promos are the masters or maybe even the heroes but this has like a lot of usable cards so i'm definitely excited to get into this and check everything out but before we get into the video guys shout out to the poodle squad member for today dark phantom 2248 shout out to you man for being a part of the poodle squad thank you so much for showing support and guys, there's a ton of stuff. You're going to need coins. Woodson. Henry. Must-haves. There's so many good cards here. Jonah Smith. If you guys do need coins, head over to my reserve down below. Use code POOTL15% off your order. Take advantage. You're going you're gonna to need coins. So make sure you're heading on over and picking them up uh, with the holiday discounts going on. Let's start with the missions tab, right? So we've got Chill Factor. This is your basic rewards and your super rewards. You want to be checking these tiers out. These are going to be your pretty much your like your pamphlet, like your guide for the Zero Chill promo. Tier 1, Tier 5, Tier 10, Tier 15, Tier 20 are going to be all your free players. So let's, let's get that out of the way first. You get a free 93 overall snow beast. It starts at an 84. You collect the 4 total beast foods and you make them into 93. You get a free choice of Nat 93 overall zero chill player. Tier 10, you get a free Nat to 93 overall. Nat 84 to 93 overall out of position player. Now it says choice of, so I'm assuming you could pick a 93 overall if you wanted to. Not sure though. And then that 92 to 94 overall uh, Ghost of Madden player again. Now, that doesn't say choice of. So I'm not entirely sure if you get to pick there. And then tier 20. By the way, if you don't know how to get this, you should get your chill factor up. So just make sure you are leveling up your chill factor by doing missions, playing objectives. Literally, it says increase your chill factor by playing zero chill events. Every time it increases, you get rewards. Get your level as high as you can before January 4th. Now, tier 20, you get a nat 92 to 93 overall pack. Contains players from the entire program. So that's five free total players just from this alone, plus snow, plus money, plus five store packs. You get so much good stuff, guys. It's probably the best, like, this is the best reward system we've ever had. Just free packs, free players. Not from that, guys, we got the zero chill missions right here, too. Just go through them. Definitely make sure you always read these, because if you don't read these, you're going to probably be a little bit lost on what we're dealing with. Let's head over to the store as well. Let's give you guys a look at some of the packs here. So here are all the stuff, the bundles, the players. Um, like the, uh, the guarantee packs, the big bundles. Now these are the Zero Chill Fantasy packs. Which actually, they look super cool. Some super cool card art on that. We got the 500, like that little cheapy pack they always give us, but still five bucks. I mean, regardless. And then the Zero Chill stuff. So here are the presents now. They have a random present pack. Now, I don't know if I'm going to be opening up the random present pack right now. I can collect some snow. I may do a video later. If you guys want to see that, let me know. I'll open up like 10 of them in a the video. But there's just so many, there's so much presents options here. There's some hot cocoa. Beast food collectibles. So I guess this is if you want to make multiple snow beasts, you open up this and this. You get four collectibles plus an additional snow beast fantasy pack. That's probably how you end up doing that. But overall, that's all of that. Now let's head on over to the um, sets. Check out all the players, of course. The master sets. Now the players are going for super cheap for like a second when they first dropped. Now they're going back down. So go to Master Derek Henry. So here's the set. You need three players. Three of the heroes is Kenyon Drake, Odell, Zach Ertz, and then 85 to 91, 85 to 91. 85 to 91, 85 to 91. Jeez, are they all 85 to 91s? All right, it appears like that. This that's kind of expensive, to be completely honest. Now, when I first hopped on before, yeah, 139. Okay, they're still super cheap. I thought they'd go back up. They went up like temporarily and then right back down. So that's good. That's good. This, this set's gonna cost so just off face value, these three players alone, 140, 140, 140. That's costing like 420-ish, give or take, right? Maybe 520. Am I doing my math wrong there? 420 total is what we're looking at for these three cards and you got to get all of these which are like another 20k so that's 20 times six so that's 120 so you're looking at 540 total for derrick henry which isn't horrible considering getting three 93 overall players it's not entirely horrible the only issue is that i don't know if Kenyon drake or zach Ertz are that usable odell maybe let's try charles woodson now with charles woodson um gino atkins is usable now the thing is though i don't think that justin houston's usable at all and then I don't think Malcolm Jenkins is that usable, so 
end of the day, it doesn't really seem likely that either one of these set, like, you can do them for money purposes, depending on what players you have, but I don't know if either of these uh, sets are going to be, like, super great. I have to have to do the math on them, check them out. But moving on from that, guys, let's go check out the players in the auction block. Let's check out some stats. I want to see Derek, uh, the Masters and everything, of course. Now, a few minutes ago, they didn't have a filter for Zero Chill, which is kind of annoying. Let's see if they fixed that already. Could have taken time for it to get into the game and everything, of course, but let's go check it out. Program. Now, I could be blind, but I do not see anything related to Zero Chill, right? Okay. Thought it was just me. Does not look like it. Let's go to newest, though, because we know they're going to be posted. So, Derek Henry. This is exciting. This is an exciting card right here. 92 speed, 90 excel, 84 agility, 94 carrying, 84 change of direction, 95 trucking, 95 break tackle, um, 86 strength, 84 agility. Let's see what else we got here. 94 carrying, of course, 89 juke. That's actually pretty solid for a Derrick Henry card because powered up, you will have a 90 juke, so that's good. Stiff arm is going to be a 97 powered up. He's going to have a crazy good stiff arm. His truck is going to be 96. His change of direction sucks, guys, but he might be the best power back in the game by a long shot. This Derek Henry looks pretty good, not going to lie, because he does get the 93 speed powered up. 93 speed is going to be 247 pounds, 6'3", 93 speed. Could he feel like Bo Jackson? It's possible. Could he be an insane up-the-middle monster? It's very possible as well. We have to see. Now, honestly, I feel like his change of direction really isn't that bad. I mean, in real life, he's pretty agile. I know it's not like probably 95, but I mean, like, an 84 is kind of low. But yeah, his juke is accurate. I mean, like, he, he makes some good, he makes good cuts, right? Which I guess you can't consider that juking, but he's a really good cutter when uh, reading holes and cutting up. If you watch any games, you know Derrick Henry is the king of cutting up field or cu cutting into a, a lane and then taking it 40-50 after that. Now let's go check out Charles Woodson, of course, as well. Go to newest again. Let's go check out, where is he? Okay, Charles Woodson. These cards are actually getting pretty cheap already. That's out of faster than I thought. Now, we, we, know, we know the base stats, right? So powered up and chemed up guy is going to have 94 speed with 99 man. Gonna be insane over 90 zone, over 90 press. Gonna be the best cornerback in the game. Now, let's see, 88 catching. Whoa. That's insane catching. He's gonna be making some crazy interceptions. He's gonna be getting so many animations. 95 change of direction powered up is insane as well. He's gonna have some after the ball ability while running. That's fun. He's gonna be, he's gonna be like Deion Sanders. This Charles Woodson is one of the best cornerbacks I've ever seen drop at any specific time. I really like this card. You gotta pick up this Charles Woodson. You definitely have to pick up cards I think you should pick up. One of them being Jonu Smith. This card has to be picked up. Now, you have to thaw him out. And I'm not sure if he's auctionable after the fact because of how you have to thaw him. So, if you guys know, I can't show you the stats. He's not up yet or if he can't even be up. But Jonu Smith, you have to go to the Hot Cocoa, collect Hot Cocoa, and you got to thaw out for a Jonu Smith. It's not that it's complicated, but it's going to take a little bit of time. Either people haven't done it yet or maybe the cards aren't auctionable after you do that. Either or, you, you definitely need that Jonu Smith. 92 speed on the tight end is absolutely insane. Now, let's get you got these solo challenges, of course. Let's see what we're working with there. Solos. And now let's head on over to, let's see, let's see, it's all the way up here. Why don't you start me at the bottom? How the Grouch one miss Mr. Grouch. So make sure you're playing these guys. You can get a ton of snow from all this. Look at all this snow, all this chill factor. There's just tons of rewards. Definitely play through this. And it's themed. Always nice to have some themed solos like the Grouch or the Grinch. Then there's the EA Play Souls, which are really good too. 50 snow, 50 snow, 50 snow. Medium plus present packs really good as well. And you get some other stuff as well there. And I mean, yeah, I mean, there's not much right now. I mean, there's only part, I believe this is part one, maybe mixed with part two. But we have, we have four total parts, so we're going to have plenty more coming. So don't, don't, don't think that for a second. That, like, we, we have a lot right now, right? Like, we have a lot in terms of players, and that's only part one, maybe part two. But we have still three and four. We still have Ghost of Madden. We still have out of position players. We still have LTDs. We probably still have a house rolls or something. There's so much left in this promo. But guys, that's pretty much it for this video specifically. I covered from what's covered on this one. I'm going to come back next with what to do first. I'm going to be ranking the best snow beast to pick. And then I'm also going to be going ahead and making a few other videos to like present. That's what it. Enjoy the rest of your day. Uh, if you guys need coins, and you probably do, head over to my reserve down below. Use code Poodle for 15% off. Take advantage of the holiday discounts. Make sure to subscribe, turn on the noti bell. I'm out. Peace.